Hey folks, it's Mike Murphy. Today's quick tip is an Adobe Audition CC 2019. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to use the slip tool in the multi-track of Adobe Audition. You'll find the slip tool up here in the toolbar. It's the one with the double arrows. It's in between the razor tool and the time selection tool and the keyboard shortcut is the letter Y. When the slip tool is selected, you'll see that your cursor turns into that double arrow. The slip tool has one main purpose, and that is to allow you to shift the contents within a trimmed clip. This also works if you're working with musical loops. And you can see here that I'm able to shift the contents within this trimmed clip without moving the clip itself. A trimmed clip just means that there is more information than you can visibly see on this clip. So if I go to the beginning of this track, also known as the head, you can see here that I can extend it out. There is more information. This has been trimmed. And I can do the same thing at the end of this clip, also known as the tail, and you'll see that there is more information here. This clip has been trimmed. You'll see this purple clip here is the entire clip. It has not been trimmed on either edge, so if I try to use the slip tool, it does nothing. And now for an example of when you might use the slip tool. Let's say that I want to fill in this gap in between the green and the purple clips and I want to use this pink clip. You can see this is too long, so the first thing we need to do is trim it. So I'm going to come to the very beginning of this clip, also known as the head, and I'm just going to pull in. I use the smart guides to know when I'm lined up. I do the same at the end of this clip, also known as the tail. I'm just going to pull in, look for the smart guides, and now I have the exact duration that I want. I'll just pull it into place. Now I'll come up here and grab the slip tool or use the keyboard shortcut Y. I'll click inside of that trimmed clip and now I can shift the content to get it to the exact spot that I want without changing the duration of that clip. My name is Mike Murphy and that is how you use the slip tool in Adobe Audition CC 2019. Cheers.